the side right now. A little yeah. bit of fog in spots. We've seen kind of mist and some light showers around the metro. We did have some heavier rain overnight. There were some strong thunderstorms going in central Nebraska. As they moved toward eastern and southeast Nebraska, they pretty much fizzled out. And at this point, the center of this upper level of the storm is moving right over the metro. That's why we're seeing this kind of comma shape here on the radar imagery. But we're really just left with light showers and a couple stragglers right behind it. So that was one upper level disturbance moving through a secondary one now moving into Wyoming. That's going to fuel some more showers and storms heading into tonight. We're not expecting anything severe, but I do think some heavier rain, maybe a little bit of lightning. This will be more of the rain than the thunderstorms. It's just going to mean really a dreary weekend. We're going to keep a lot of clouds around heading into Sunday. I am optimistic we can see some sunshine though this afternoon. We're at 70 out at Epley. Winds are calm at the moment. They won't be calm all day long, but light out of the southeast. We're still in the lower 70s to our south, but most of the region here in the 60s. Still 64 in Fort Dodge, 68 Des Moines, 68 also in Kirksville and muggy outside. We're going to have the mugginess around Saturday and Sunday. Dew points mid to upper 60s. They'll be around 70 this afternoon. We'll basically repeat that on Sunday. So near oppressive humidity at times. The temperatures won't be skyrocketing. We'll be in the lower 80s, but it just won't be very comfortable around here. Storm predictor trying to clear us out early afternoon, at least in eastern Nebraska. Likely still some clouds in western Iowa. Not too concerned with the light rain threat as we hit this afternoon. Early evening, still no problems. But as we head into later on, this evening and early tonight. Clouds on the increase and then storm predictor here bring a nice line of storms right through here for early Sunday morning. We're going to keep a few of these showers and storms around, scattered ones at that for later on in the morning on Sunday. I think we're mostly dry as we head into Sunday afternoon. Storm predictor, this particular computer model, is trying to keep a lot of scattered showers and storms around. I think for Iowa, that's certainly a possibility. I'm really not too concerned with eastern Nebraska. At the same time, though, it's not going to be sunny around here. It's not going to be dry or comfy by any means. We'll likely see some mist and some drizzle at times. Sunday night, though, we start to get some drier air working in, and that will mean some great news by Monday. Sunny skies, no humidity, or at least much less humidity. 81 for the high. Tuesday, pretty similar. 79 for the high. A little bit warmer as we hit the middle of the week. 84 on Wednesday. Then we'll see more of a kind of progressive pattern in the upper levels of the atmosphere. That'll bring a couple of upper level disturbances through and give us a slight chance of some thunderstorms Thursday and Friday. Okay, thanks, Cal. You're welcome. On the World Watch this morning, in